now you guys know how to set your suspension preload and rebound it's time to get to the final piece which is compression welcome to the final episode of the suspension workshop series where today we will teach you how to set your compression with a single and a double rider on the motorcycle let's go So, what is compression? In easy words, compression damping helps the suspension absorb bumps as the wheel moves upwards in a stroke. If it is set too firm, when you hit the bump, the motorcycle will bounce over it and there will be no immediate wheel contact because there is not enough compression to absorb the force. If it's too soft, the suspension will be compressed too much by the motorcycle's weight transfer over the bump. So, how do we set the correct suspension compression? Here's how. If you are riding alone, turn the compression adjustment fully clockwise to the firmest position. Decrease it by adjusting the compression softer by turning it anti-clockwise and test it on a bump again. A suitable compression setting should allow the motorcycle to properly absorb the bumps in a proper rate which is not too fast or not too slow. On the other hand, if you are carrying a pillion rider, it means there is additional weight. Adjust the compression firmer by turning it clockwise. Test them out on the road again and do not stop adjusting until you get the suitable adjustment, not too fast or not too slow. Lastly, setting the compression adjustment on a monoshock is just as the same on the dual suspension. But instead of adjusting both, you just have to adjust once. Clockwise, firmer and anti-clockwise softer. And that my friends sum up these final adjustments in this compression episode. We certainly hope that these three episodes of suspension preload rebound and compression will certainly help you guys to fully utilize our quality ranges of suspensions and monoshocks. Thanks for staying tuned. Until next time, I'll see you around.